Hallelujah to Jesus. Father, we bless your holy name. We worship you, ancient of days. Take all the glory in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. This is God's own channel with Evangelist Sarah. You are welcome. The Lord bless you. The Lord bless every member of this household. It is well with the child of God. Jesus love you. And I love you. Please, family, like this video. Share, subscribe. Tell somebody about this ministry. God bless you as you do that. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. Glory to Jesus. <laughs> Before I share this message, I really quickly want to tell somebody to remind someone out there that rumors are spread by haters and believe by fools. Rumors, you see rumors, especially lies, lies about innocent somebody, they are spread by haters. You might be asking yourself, who is spreading all this news about me? Who is spreading all this news about me, child of God? Who is spreading the news that you know nothing about about you? <laughs> it is haters. And those that believe it without confirmation, they are the fools. The Bible says, fool says in their heart, there is no God. Why? Because they are corrupt. If they have the fear of God, if they are not corrupt, they will seek their face and seek the truth and say, well, let me find out if this is the truth. No, they are willing to jump into anything at all. As long as it is concerns your name, when they hear it, ah, it is you, they, it's true, ah, it's true. You are like, ah, somebody who have not even met you, who have never spoken with you, just heard something about you and it starts spreading. It starts spreading. <laughs> oh God, the negativity that they are spreading concerning each other of God <laughs> is not going to bring you down. I hear this one so strongly. There is something spreading faster than the good that you have done. You know, you can do 99% good for someone. And the person will not even tell another person. You will not even hear thank you. You will not even hear, oh, beloved, you have done well. Thank you for this 99 good that you have done for me. But the moment you dare do one that is wrong, ah, that 99% that you have done, they are, forgo they are forgotten. They will just sweep it under the carpet. They will take that one wrong that you did. They will use it and spread lies all in all the city in the churches, among their friends, among their brethren, among the haters, they will spread and spread and spread and spread. Something so negative is spreading about somebody. You are asking yourself, where are the good I have done in life? Child of God, hear me very well. <laughs> you are not a bad person. <laughs> oh God. You need to understand that the target is to turn your good into evil. Saying all sorts of things about you, that you are not a good person, you are this. Even Jesus, despite on him, the Bible says they call him all sorts of names. Oh, if you are the son of God, why can't you save yourself? And you say you are going to destroy the temple and build it back in three days. Now save yourself. Why? Because they did not even understand what he was saying when he said he would destroy this temple in three days he would build it back they did not even understand what he was saying they start spreading it look at who said is the messiah look at him who says the king of just look at him you see that is the life that we are in you ask yourself where is the good that he did before he was crucified before they even took him, where are they good? No one was talking about that anymore. No one was spreading that. You're asking yourself, nah, what about the good I did for this person? Ah, forget the good. Because the world choose to accept what they want to accept. Just remain being good. Because they will still see something to say. They are spreading that negativity because they are fools. If they have God in them, they will seek for wisdom. They will seek for confirmation. Don't argue with fools. 
When you argue with a fool, you automatically can become a fool. When you argue, when you... The fact that somebody is crazy does not mean you should join the person to be crazy. Let them keep spreading whatever they want to spread about you. Remain steadfast in the Lord. <laughs> Remain steadfast in the Lord. You don't need to live your life to justify, to please anyone. You please God. And you do what is right in the, in the sight of God and man. Even if man refuse to accept that is the right thing, but before God and man, you do what is right. I pray the Lord give you wisdom. It is well with you, Jesus, love you. And I love you with the love of Christ. I remain your sister, Evangelist Sarah. By the grace of God, I will see you again. Bye-bye.